it's Tanya and I thought I would come on and show you what I have left of my October kits because I think I did them really quite well. Papers not so much but uh, I did a lot of... I got a lot of use out of the embellishments so let's go through it. These were the Dear Lizzie Stargazer gigantic words that we got and I have two left. So I will keep those because they're nice. And then I have, as I said, quite a lot of the paper left over. I don't know why I sometimes... <laughs> I always seem to have a lot of paper left over. A lot of these offcuts I'm not going to keep. You know, there's a... It'll go in the recycling bin. I tend to keep full 12 by 12s that I haven't used, and there are. Okay, so those are all the offcuts. And then full 12 by 12s. I've got one, two, three, four, five six that's not too bad hey six and then of course i still have some of the watercolor paper that came in the color add-on and yeah cardstock i always end up with lots of cardstock left over because i don't use too much of that so all of that can go into my stash for another time and yeah look at this out of all of the kits and you, as you know i do get all of them this is all i have left obviously letter stickers i have quite a few of um so yeah didn't do many of my long titles this time, so I didn't use up a lot of those. So those will also go into my stash. These, I will confess, I didn't really take to. Very, very fall and Thanksgiving type thing. And that didn't fit in with the project that I was doing. And that was to scrap my Khalakhari adventure. So, yeah. Um, yeah. I will donate them to somebody. <laughs> of those enamel crosses I have that these just seem to go on and on, on and on forever I don't know you use a billion of them on a project and yet there's still a billion more so those I can keep in my stash again these were very autumnal and uh, you know cold and chilly and fireside so I did use quite a few considering considering my subject matter I did use you know, you think you use a lot of these and then it doesn't look like you do, but I did. Of the Pocket Life cards, I have that left. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that little off cut. And then of the embellishments, I have this. That goes with that. Those stars. I have a couple of stars, as you can see. There's hardly anything left on those. I have one little triangle left, and that. That is literally it. So I think I did well. And let me show you what I did create. More stars, because stars are everywhere. I created four layouts and a complete traveler's notebook. So the layouts they all have process videos for, and they are in the Facebook forum for the Hip Kit Club. And yeah, so yeah, my cute little meerkat. And this one I thought was kind of cute, a little fox, he's a cape fox, and then our ground squirrels, I really enjoyed making this one. You can see the reason why I don't have many embellishments left is I am an embellishment heavy scrapper. Yes, and that actually used cardstock. Yeah. And I printed this on, on cardstock as well, which is why it looks a little bit not like a proper photo, because it's not, but I thought it was quite a quite a nice uh, texture to it. So I thought I was a bit, in, not inventive, but a bit uh, uh, different there. Different for me. And then yes, my traveller's notebook. Let's do the share, shall we? Poor thing, it's got a bit, uh, <laughs> got a bit thick and it's kind of coming apart. But uh, here we go. And I do tippins because I love to do tippins. So there we go. And more tippins. Yeah, you can tell if there's washi tape, it's going to be a tippin. And there is my gorgeous lion. Again, a tippin. <laughs> uh, there we go, there we go, there we go, there's a tippin. Oh, and this was a wonderful, wasn't it? And I can't take it off to turn it around. <laughs> so we're just going to ignore that little boo boo. Ignore the boo boos. And there's a little fox, and here you can see where it's now starting to come apart a bit. But that's okay. Uh, oh, there's a tippin. There we go. And these both do that. 
So you can see actually in your traveler's notebooks you can use up a hang of a lot of stuff. And I started, I even got those words in here. I pulled them off the backing. And that's a fairly plain one, but look at my photo here. And yes, there, I've got another one. That one doesn't. And here is where I, I actually glued some of these. I glued some of the pages together and I took some of the pages out because I knew it was going to get fat. So, and I don't mind putting in these kind of letters in it. It doesn't matter. They're, they're firm, so they're squishy. And there is my little travel log that I washi taped together and little made a little pocket for it. And there, that is my trip chronicled in a traveller's notebook and with some 12 by 12 nails. So, thanks for watching and I'm looking forward to scrapping with the November kits which are on sale, so rush to the website and have a look. Thanks for watching, bye!